Hi, this is Matt Toussaint, uh, the developer of Subterfuge. Today we're going to go through a real quick install of Subterfuge on Kali Linux version 1.0.2 and this is Subterfuge version 5.0. So we're going to start off by downloading it off of the uh, web page. We'll go ahead and save that into the root folder in Kali. Now we've downloaded the source tarball. We're going to go ahead and extract it. Now it's extracted. We need to go into the subterfuge folder. And now we need to run the installer. The installer is in Python and it's graphical. So it should run fairly easily for us. All right, so there's a graphical installer. We're going to do a full stall with dependencies. Install that. Now Subterfuge is installing all of the dependencies. Uh, it's making sure SQLite is on the uh, machine, installing to Django, which it uses to um, host its web server. Also installs ARP tables and a couple of the dependencies for Subterfuge in order to get the uh, entire project to run. Now that it's done, a little finish window pops up. We click finish and we can start up Subterfuge. Uh, by default, Subterfuge will start on the local host. It'll bind to port 80. So if we go back to our web browser and browse to localhost, there's Subterfuge. Please note that Subterfuge is a Linux-only tool and will not install under Windows or OS X. Hopefully this tutorial has been informative for you and has helped alleviate some of the difficulties installing Subterfuge. Thanks for viewing.